And we're underway. Muse will not try to run it out. On the rollout, he's on target to Marcus Rosamie Jack Saint. He goes out into the flat. Beck has room to run for the first down. Decided not to slide and got hit by De'Eric Jackson. Play action pass. Beck was looking deep. Throws it deep. Rosemey Jackson has the touchdown. Well, that is not a slow start. This is the way you do it. You see Kentucky selling out against the run. Zion Childress. Carson Beck, four for four. And comes out firing again. Still perfect. First down. Drives for the come from behind win. Faked it to Edwards. Man wide open. It's Bowers taken down inside the 40 by Maxwell Hairston. They'll mark it at the 36. And job one tonight is stopping him. They didn't that time. Here he comes again. A tight end screen. Good for 11 more. Left after last season to be the offensive coordinator for the Baltimore Ravens. Back wide open in the flat. Edwards. Edwards dives down. They're averaging more than 10 yards per play on their first two possessions. To the end zone. And it is incomplete. Rara Thomas went in the air. Really close. A great job by Thomas high pointing it. But look at that left foot. After video review, it is a touchdown. So a touchdown, his first as a Georgia Bulldog. It's Edwards looking for some space. And he has the first down taken down by De'Eric Jackson, the senior. Last win for Kentucky against Georgia was in 2009. They've lost 13 straight. And that pass batted out of the air by Deion Walker. Kentucky players think it's a free ball. Here comes another flag. After the play, personal foul, unnecessary roughness, defense, number zero. 15 yard penalty from the previous spot and an automatic first down. Great. Number two tight end alongside Bowers drafted in the third round. Going with quick tempo. Third down and five. Movement along the line. Looks like it's going against Kentucky. And the ball is caught by Rosemey Jackson. First down conversions. Very important player on third down. Wide open Oscar Delp for the Georgia touchdown. And you're going to see, obviously, a full sell by Kentucky against the run. A similar play that they hit Brock Bowers on earlier. March down the field in the final two minutes without a timeout to score the winning touchdown. Ray Davis, another beautifully designed and executed play. 0.7 yards per play. And the line is protecting Larry well. He's on target again for a first down to midfield to Dane Key. Georgia crowding the line. Larry on target. And Tavion Robinson the first down. Davis, lots of running room. And a first down inside the five. Off the play fake, Leary. Corner to the end zone. And it is caught by Josh Caddis for a Kentucky touchdown. Just an enormous answer for Kentucky. They go with a little 321 loop pass right, loop that quarterback out, designed to throw it in the flat. You almost never throw it to the corner. But in this case, Leary likes the matchup. He sees the defender. Malachi Starks is back, is to him. Three possessions, three drives, 75, 82, and 95. And here they come again. Brock Bowers. How did he get so wide open? 
passed his career high of 338 a couple of weeks ago against UAB. Looking for his fourth touchdown pass of the half. Oh my goodness, take Bauer's scholarship away. <laughs> Last year, Beck is the holder. And that 36 yarder is good. So Woodring is 7 out of 10 now in field goals. They just did get it off, and he's under the rest and buried. Back at the 25. Jamon Dumas Johnson for Georgia. With Edwards running off left guard and powering his way for a first down and more. Each team with all three timeouts. Kentucky brings a blitz. Deep drop by Beck and Rosemary Jacks ain't another big play. Time is no problem for them with an eye towards scoring again. If anything, they'd probably like to take as much time off as they can and then score. Bowers in any hurry. Takes the clock all the way down. A low snap and a touchdown. Kendall Milton. And it's 30 to 7, Georgia. And just a great job here by the right side of the offensive line. As you can see on the right side, Xavier Trust just securing the edge and kind of hooking the defender inside. Let's see if they get aggressive. You would think they would with as well as they've moved it. There was some movement, but no flags. They are going deep into single coverage and incomplete. Intended for Ron, Ron Thomas, and here come the flags. Passing appearance, defense for 28. Still 17 seconds and all three timeouts. They check it down to Edwards. And that should be in field goal range. But in the high school, he made a 60 yard field goal and a couple of more than 50 last year. This will get him closer to the 24 yard line. That looked like the form of a young man who was the number one high school kicker in the country last year. Dylan Fairchild, Tate Ratledge, the guards. They didn't have a great day at Auburn. On target, first down. Just a three man rush for Kentucky. In a traffic, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Maxwell Hairston. And with some running room along the near sideline. And chopped down by Beck. Inside the 30. The quarterback was another reason why he wanted to come back to Kentucky. Wide open Davis. First down inside the 10. Touchdown, Kentucky. Another great call by Liam Cohen and well executed by the Cats. 26 yards. Davis, the running back on the right hip, O'Leary. They direct snap it to Davis. Trying to. Surge toward the end zone. He got stacked up well short. Carson Beck hands it off. Edwards powers for the first down. Georgia scored on all six possessions in the first half. Turned it over here early in this half. Wow, the effort by Milton. Third down and uh, very short. And Beck has the first down. Rara Thomas and Dominic Lovett were the best receiver on a, another SEC team last year. And they still have this guy. Players are enormously talented. The speed of the game is a direct snap to Brock Bowers on third down and five. And he got driven back after a short game. The only tight end in the top 10 in the voting since 1977, Ken McAfee. It's supposed to go to the best player. 69 straight sellouts and they love it. Jamon Dumas Johnson with his second sack. On third down and nine. Beck quick throw. Caught. Beautiful throw through it in the perfect place for Ron Rod Thomas. Touchdown. Powers is wide open. Touchdown. 21 yards, his first touchdown reception of the night. And 24th of his career, he moves out of a tie for second. All time in Georgia with A.J. Green, only Terrence Edwards with more. He had 30 touchdown receptions.
from 99 through 2002. It's Brock Vandegriff on for his second series. Hands it off to Cash Jones, the former walk-on. Before he had his boo-boo on his knee, but now here's Vandegriff taking off. The loss in any game was in the SEC championship game in December of 2021 to Alabama. So they started the winning streak. That's Andrew Paul, the redshirt freshman Andrew from Paul, Dallas. Van de Griff. Fires showing off his arm on target to the 20 yard line to Pierce Sperlin. I'm just not really sure how to feel about them at the moment. Van de Griff wants Lucky to block for him. He got chopped down. Van de Griff's four out of six for 39 since coming in for Beck. Andrew Paul to the pylon, touchdown!